Good morning. My name is Anthony Lopez. And I'm Adriana Zavala. Today we will be reading Hairs Pelitos as part of For the People and Kids Hispanic Heritage Month weekend reading series. Hairs Pelitos was written by Sandra Cisneros and illustrations by Terry Ivanes. Sandra is a Chicana writer best known for her award-winning book, The House on Mango Street, an excellent book about 12-year-old Esperanza Cordero growing up in a Hispanic neighborhood in Chicago. We chose to read this book because in our families, we all have different types of hair. Maybe it's the same in your family. The book is in both English and Spanish. I'll be reading the English. And I'll be reading the Spanish. Let's begin. Hairs Pelitos by Sandra Cisneros, illustrated by Terry Ivanes. Everybody in our family has different hair. Todos en nuestra familia tenemos pelo diferente. My papa's hair is like a broom, all up in the air. El pelo de mi papá es como una escoba, todo parado de punta. And me, my hair is lazy. It never obeys barrettes or bands. Y yo, mi pelo es flojo. Nunca obedece a broches y a diedamas. Carlos's hair is thick and straight. He doesn't need to comb it. El pelo de Carlos es grueso y lacio. No necesita peinárselo. Nanny's hair is slippery. Slides out of your hand. El pelo de Nanny es resbaloso. Se escurre de tu mano. And Kiki, who is youngest, has hair like fur. Y Kiki, el más chiquito, tiene pelo como peluche. But my mother's hair, my mother's hair, like little rosettes, like little candy circles, all curly and pretty because. Pero el pelo de mi mamá, el pelo de mi mamá, como rositas, como rueditas de dulce, todos chinitas y lindas, porque. She pinned it in pin curls all day, sweet to put your nose into when she is holding you. Se hizo anchoas con pasadores todo el día. Dulce cuando pones tu nariz en el cuando ella te abraza. Holding you and you feel safe is the warm smell of bread before you bake it. Cuando te abraza y se siente segura es el olor tibio a pan antes de hornearlo. is the smell when she makes room for you on her side of the bed, still warm with her skin. Es el olor cuando te hace un campito en su lado de la cama todavía calientito de su piel. And you sleep near her, the rain outside falling and Papa snoring. Y te duermes cerca de ella La lluvia cayendo afuera y papá roncando. The snoring, the rain, and mama's hair that smells like bread. Los ronquidos, la lluvia y el pelo de mamá que huele a pan. Thank you for joining us this morning and we hope you enjoyed the book. If you'd like to purchase the book, please go to wordupbooks.com and enter this discount code. We hope that you're having a great Hispanic Heritage Month. Please be sure to check out the other readings every Saturday and Sunday morning. Gracias, cuídense. Ciao.